appreciate that, sir. Do you, clean, do you clean leaves off the roof? Yes, I can. Hello, another beautiful spring day here in uh, in New York. We are going to be doing a roof wash today on this portion of the roof, right here over the mud roof or a uh, mud room. We're gonna be doing some moss removal up through here on this strip. There's another strip right here on this side. Okay, it might be hard to see the railing in the way, but there's some moss up and down there. And then we have this section here. This is the kind of moss you want to see when you're going to do a roof wash. There's all kinds of moss out there. Some of it's stubborn. This stuff right here, it's gonna brush off real nice. Barely putting a finger on it. Um, as you can see, it's very damp out here. We've had a lot of rain. That's a very uh, nice benefit of doing <clears throat> a roof wash, <clears throat> moss removal. After some rain, it's just gonna be very, very easy, very, very delicate. It's just gonna wanna come right off. So um, I can't always predict the weather, but it is nice when it works in your favor. Plants are all wet, they've been soaked. It's early spring, there's not a lot of flowering yet. So spring is a really nice time of year to be doing these kind of washes.
okay we are all done here as you can see much much lighter okay all those black streaks are off come over here we do this little section all that copper whatever that might be at the bottom that's all cleaned up a little bit we did get a lot of that bulky stuff off you can see the rest of that moss is nice and white there we're going to go in there with our hose and just rinse that tin off a little bit <clears throat> a lot of moss came from up here okay that was uh more or less a carpet <laughs> as you can see some big chunky pieces there so that's looking a lot better got this all got the deck sprayed off and everything that's what we're looking at here then this last section look at that lightening up might put another spray you can see it's a little dark here a little dark right by the ladder all this is lightened up all the moss is turning white little patch of uh, black up there so all in all very good we'll get this 20 out of here we'll start packing up doing some rinsing we'll come back around and check on that black spot in a couple minutes if it hasn't started to fade with the treatment that's already on there we'll go ahead and spray a little more but uh we're done we're basically done so we just got to pack up here and then we got another roof wash to do today. We're heading there right after this. All right, what up, nerds? Here we are. Our second uh, roof wash of the day. We got this side of the garage, the other side of the garage. And we got this main house here. So we'll see this as we get a little closer. But as you can see, there's a lot of nice dark streaking up on that. nice and light huh still some dark spots up there we got to hit right along the peak and then over there we're gonna check the other side okay look at that we're looking much better much much better it's still dwelling see a little dark strip here a couple spots up by the peak so we're gonna move on to another section let that stuff fully dwell and that way we can know exactly what needs to be treated here in a few minutes instead of just treating it right now i just sprayed all that um up by the peak and everything i just got that again so <clears throat> let that dwell and then we'll hit it again as we need but we've moved on
much much lighter we'll go back out here in the yard for a minute <clears throat> take a look hey look at that I'll be throwing up some before pictures as well this is the side that I just sprayed so there's still a little black there I move the ladder I want to get on this side of the chimney then we're gonna get our 30 30 foot ladder out 32 foot ladder out the back side of this chimney is a little debris I'm gonna see if I can get that And then our next order of business will be over here. Over here. Not too bad on this side, okay? Okay, we're all done. We have been here an hour and a half. <clears throat> I'm gonna take some pictures here myself. Nice and clean. Nice and clean. Simple wash. So it was both sides of this garage here. And then both sides of the main house. Hour and a half. <clears throat> Not too shabby. Not too shabby. You always want to review your work. I had to come back and spray up by the peak. Oh, drop my phone. Drop my, uh, redo some work at the peak. Here's re results this side of the, the house. Get a nice picture of the uh, garage roof from over here on the deck. So it's nice to make sure you get your pictures match up. Makes it a little easier making before and afters. Bada bing. And then this back side. I didn't take any before pictures. Back here it wasn't too bad, but we'll just uh, take a look quick and I'll show you guys. landmines and working around them in them <laughs> okay looks good all right so we're gonna get out of here um see if we can get ourselves into another roof wash today i uh i think we're going to so stay tuned okay we are here at another uh what's going to be a pretty decent sized roof wash here um Two years ago I plowed for this account I didn't end up taking it this past season um, I also washed her house her roof and then I got a nice referral over here very dark through here can get some of that crap out of the uh, out of the valleys there very dark a little bit of moss nothing we can't handle okay why well, we got the ladder set up here I want to get a brush up here and see if we can knock off some of this moss one thing I'm going to try out right now are these 510 um basically mountain bike riding shoes so i've had these for years um <clears throat> i've never used them on a roof before but a friend of mine who also bikes who also has these shoes he installs uh solar panels on roofs and that's what he wears and he says that they're unbelievable so we're going to try them out um these are horrible on roofs these are great wash shoes these huck boots incredibly comfortable keep your feet dry um they're horrible on roofs there's no ankle support or anything like that um there's no way to like tie them up and lace them so I know some guys like the cougar paws there's a bunch of different stuff out there but i i own these so we're gonna give them all right well we're up around some pretty good pitch um incredibly grippy incredibly grippy so you gotta get some of this moss out of here we'll probably work our way over work our way around this roof we're not gonna get all this moss it's in uh, some of it's in some areas that it's just not ideal for us to try to get there's not a whole lot of it but down through here there's some mushy stuff it's uh close to the ground so it's easier to see 
So we're gonna light some of this stuff up with the brush here and then probably move on with our gutter cleaning. in in a moment uh, when I'm all done here maybe uh, sure. take a walk around sure. right next door there I'm Eric I'm Neil Neil nice to meet you yeah. did you see the roof blown off uh, just the leaves in the valley okay yeah, yeah I'll see if there's something I can get to you yeah, absolutely all right sure. all right. no problem you. thank you yeah I'll pay you in care okay appreciate that thank you goodbye Steve already oh man just incredible i mean the roof was basically black missed some edges up there you can see how black it is and the spots that i missed came all the way around 29 minutes 
We went all the way down through here on this lower roof. This was kind of nice about these roofs. You get roof jobs like this, and you can just basically put up one ladder as long as you, you know, you're not a little scared of being on the roof. Okay, here we are back a day or two later. Only one, two, three. And I think one more area over here above the door needs to be retreated. We're gonna do that real quick. And then we're gonna get paid and get out of here. So this turned out really, really nice. This is still a little dark right here. And I kind of want to throw a little bit more up here. But we'll be out of here pretty quick. Uh, we did just land a house wash and pressure washing of the patio um or walkway rather in the front and the back so this has turned out to be a really nice job here um six percent bleach does magic <laughs> all right we'll see you guys